Hello everyone and welcome back to Willa Dean's Kitchen. Today we're going to show you our no fuss chicken wing recipe. This is a chicken wing recipe that we uh, put together where you can get the wings in the oven and on the table in less than an hour. Uh, it's a good thing to do if you're, you know, if somebody stops by, company stops by uh, unannounced and you just want to get something on the table so they can enjoy uh, something to eat. So what we have here is we have five chicken wings. We have them cut up uh, we have the wingettes and we have the flat so we got 10 pieces in total uh, over here we have a teaspoon of salt we have a half a teaspoon of black pepper a half a teaspoon of garlic powder and a half a teaspoon of dry oregano and over here we have two tablespoons of flour and a teaspoon of breadcrumbs and this is so to get some brown and crisp on our chicken and we have what I hope a lot of people may already have in their kitchen is some Italian dressing uh, you can use any brand whatever your favorite brand is if you don't have this you can mix together some oil and vinegar as well to substitute for the dressing so we're going to use two tablespoons of this salad dressing in our uh, no fuss chicken wings. So I'm gonna get everything together so we can get it ready for the oven. Okay, so we're gonna add our dry spices and our salt and pepper to the wings. And then we're gonna mix these up well. Mix these up good. The dry spices incorporated throughout. Okay, so we have that mixed up, and now we're going to add two tablespoons of the Italian dressing. And Italian dressing is loaded with flavor, so it's going to add flavor to our wings. And a little bit of tanginess from that vinegar that's in your Italian dressing. So we're going to mix this all up here really good. Now, this is what it should look like in your bowl. And at this point, you can do one of two things. You can pause, cover this up, put it in your refrigerator for about an hour, and let these seasonings absorb into the chicken wings. Uh, that's what I would recommend doing, but if you're in a bit of a crunch, you can go ahead and add your flour and your breadcrumbs and preheat your oven and then go ahead and put these in the oven. But what we're going to do, we're going to let them sit for an hour, then we're going to come back and finish them off. Okay, so our chicken wings have uh, been sitting here in the marinade for an hour now. So what we're going to do next is, I like to have a look, I mean, you could actually bake these like this without the flour, uh, I mean, if that's what you like, uh, but we're going to add flour because we're going to try to get a little bit of a crispy crust on the wings. So we're going to add the flour and the breadcrumbs, and now we're going to mix this all up in this bowl here, get everything mixed well, and it's going to kind of get a little sticky because of the flour but that's good so now that we have our wings mixed up this is what it's going to look like in your bowl and the next thing is we have a aluminum foil lined baking pan and I put the aluminum foil on because this is our uh, easy chicken wings no fuss so we want to make the cleanup easy as well so when you line your sheet pan with this foil you cook your wings and all you got to do is take the foil and uh, dispose of it and your your cleanup is almost done okay so we're going to add these wings onto the baking dish 
like so. And we like to spread them out so they're not touching each other. That'll let the heat flow in around and between each chicken wing. So we're gonna go in a 385 degree oven. These are gonna be baked wings. So uh, we're gonna bake them for 35 to 45 minutes or until you get a nice golden brown color on your wings. And of course, you wanna make sure they're cooked all the way through. Um, and that's another important thing. So we're gonna cook them all the way through and get a nice brown on them. And then we'll show you what, the, what it looks like. Okay, I just got the wings out the oven and we do have nice brown color on them uh, for baked wings. Uh, they um, smell great, so I'm sure they're going to taste great as well. And we're going to get these plated up on a plate so you can see what it looks like uh, when you're ready to serve. So here we have it, folks, our no fuss chicken wings um, served up on a plate. I put a little rosemary on there for garnish uh, but this is something you can put together quick and easy uh, anytime any day of the week that you like um, so I hope you enjoyed this recipe uh, we'll be putting up some more quick and easy recipes so we know that not everybody likes to spend all day in the kitchen like I do so um, stay tuned and have a great day